So my boyfriend is addicted to anime. He thinks I don't know it, but I've caught him multiple times calling me Sakura just because I have pink hair. He knows I hate that bitch. Hey Sakura, uh, Kimmy! Can you pass me the remote? Did you just call me Sakura? I didn't say Sakura, I said Kimmy, you're hearing stuff. When I come home exhausted after a long day of work, he forces me to stay up to watch anime with him. Are you falling asleep? Watch the show! Watch it! I'm so tired! Nick, open up! Your eyes! Dr. Phil, please save my boyfriend because I have a feeling I might lose him to an anime bitch. He's gonna ask questions, right? Take a look at this. Yeah, I like anime, but it's not a problem. In fact, my girlfriend is the one with a problem. She says that I'm addicted to anime, but I've came home after work and caught her watching episodes without me. Hey honey, I'm home! It, it's, it's not what it looks like. Are you watching without me? She expects me to wait for her, but when she gets home from work, she's too to. tired. Please just let me go to sleep. She says that I'm addicted to anime, but she's the one with a One Piece Funko Pop collection. Dr. Phil, I'm not the one with the problem. After today, you will see that she's the one with the problem. You're shocked by this, right? Dr. Phil, don't listen to him. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Dr. Phil, I really don't even know why I'm here. She's crazy. Is she delusional in other areas or just this area? You know what? Screw you, Dr. Phil. I thought you could help, but you can't.